And we're going for the three wide formation for the kids on the back stretch. Just to give the kids a bit of a big salute. So, folks, why don't you put your hands together and give these kids a big round of applause and wish them good luck for their final. It's been a big moment for the kids to come out and run tonight with us. So, please put your hands together for your entire junior sedan feature race field and wish these little tackers all the very best because they have put on some mighty racing. Metcalf and Shaw will be on the front row together. Cam Smith right alongside Mitch McClure. Kai McEwen and Riley Gregg. Ryan Burns. Diesel Fallon. So... All three pace vehicles moving off the circuit as we get set to go for this 10-lapper to wrap up the juniors and then the A-mains for mods and sprint cars to come your way. Carter Metcalf, the new Australian champion. What a moment for him and Will Shaw, his buddy. They've been riding mini quads since they were just two or three years of age. So it's great that they've grown up together inside the sport. Away we go. Gee, they've very well behaved off the launch. Metcalf bogged down just a little off the line and Will Shaw is desperate to be able to get a win on his buddy. Not take the gloss off the Australia one, but just to get a win. I don't know what's happened to our buddy Bo Oldfield, but he is not out there. He's been a stout proposition all night. He's done a really good job. But basically, tonight hasn't shown up for the A-Main. So I hope nothing too dramatic has happened to that car. As we go caution. Results out of Toowoomba. Just saw Ian Madsen getting the win from Luke Oldfield and Jock Goodger. Carter Metcalf, the Aussie champ. Let's see whether he can get a run on him or not. Final night of the season for these kids. Mitch McClure nibbling on the tail of Cameron Smith. Metcalf, he'll be desperate to beat Will. And Will, in turn, desperate to beat him. And Cam Smith would love to win his first ever main event here with both these guys in the house. So if he can somehow pull that off, be quite a moment. Metcalf puts the A1 onto the left rear of Will Shaw. Nothing in it between the lead trio. Metcalf again gets a run down the back straight, thinks about the inside groove, drops to the middle. Will's got the foot nailed to the floor. He knows he can't afford to lift. Five laps to go. What a ripping little battle between these three. Oh, Carter asking the question. Now Cameron Smith. Cam is right there. Has been speedy all night. Without a doubt, the best I've ever seen Cameron Smith drive. Has he got the momentum? Carter has got his hands full trying to get by Will. Who's got it perched beautifully on the ledge. Just enough speed. And Cameron... You would think is in the box seat. Metcalf goes to the bottom. Can he make it stick there? They're side by side. Three to go. Will close the door a bit that time. He realized that Metcalf got a run. Now Cam Smith on the top. They're going to come up on Frosty Foe. They go right through the middle on Frosty. A little bit of right side romance for Metcalf on the lap car. One to go. Will, Carter and Cameron. What a tremendous race between these three. Metcalf goes to the bottom on Smith. Will Shaw will hold on. Just 
over Carter Metcalf and Cameron Smith. Mitch McClure will get fourth. Back to Riley Gregg, Kai McEwen, Diesel Fallon. What a race. Come on, Mildura, put your hands together for these kids. That was fantastic. Will Shaw gets the final win tonight and beats his mate, the Aussie champion. Plugger McCarthy comes over to give the kid the Aussie flag and he'll say well done to the little smash dab. That was a great race. Respect to all those kids getting after it. So Will will take the checkered flag for a quick lap around BNS Earthworks, Timmer Speedway. And we'll have the first of our A mains to come in just a moment. So I think Will's trying to grab a gear here at the moment. He would have loved getting the job done over his buddy Carter Metcalf. And what a way to do it with the Aussie champ. So, quick discussion going on with him and Plug. And they're giving the checkered flag out to young Frosty Foe. Now, Frosty, Frosty won the Australian Sub Junior Speedway Karting Championship. They're giving him a checkered flag here as well. He might be the first of the second class within the juniors. So, great little moment for Frosty. We never got to celebrate his win as the Australian sub-junior Speedway Kart champion, but well done to him. So, well done to all the kids as we get set here in a moment for your A-mains. Come on, folks, as he comes around turn number four onto the main straight, make plenty of noise for him. Support the kids. I know mum and dad. So I'm told, I'm told, Kerbs, that we might be looking down the barrel of some reverse donuts. Okay. I'm told that Will wants to throw a couple of reverse donuts with the front wheel drive. This is going to be interesting. Yeah, it is going to be interesting. So... You see the big boys do it with the sprint cars and sedans and things like that. Well, I'm told that Will wants to lay down the reverse donuts in the Adam Holt Industries number 15. So I'm talking it up. You better not let me down. Here we go. Right in front of the bar. Best possible place to do it. He's got it going good too. How's that? <laughs> Come on, folks. Make plenty of noise for him. <laughs> How good is that? I don't think I've ever seen that before. Come on, Timmy Speedway. Put your hands together for him. How good was that? Well done, young man. And he's a very smart operator because he went and did it in front of the bar. <laughs> Let's face it. Now, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the Modifieds. Murray Magic. We're going to ask you to get your phones out in a moment. He's still going, Wade. <laughs> this is incredible. <laughs> no rev limiter. No. By all reports. Wouldn't be surprised if there's something that falls out of the Mum bottom. Mum and Dad, that. Travis and Karen will be wrapped <laughs> with this. <laughs> now he's going forward. How good is that? Good job, Will. Nice job. Nice to see him back after injuring himself earlier in the year. Ladies and gentlemen, get your phones out, please. We're about to go four wide with tonight's modified.